Hello. Uh, here in India, we are in the fourth phase of the lockdown uh, to fight the coronavirus pandemic. When I look at this lockdown period, of course, people have miseries, people have pain, people requires healing. There are traumatic situations for families. But amidst all of this, there have been several lessons. And not only lessons about how to fight the pandemic, how to fight against Corona, but there are very subtle spiritual messages that the universe have sent to the human being. And I thought it is important to share these revelations with all of you. The revelation number one that I think that humanity must take it very seriously is to know that we are not supreme. We are probably as equal as the microscopic level virus and in fact that entire virus can bring the humanity to a screeching halt. So those of us who have this sense of ego and overzealed pride that I can do anything, I am super uh, intelligent, I can rule the world, I can ruin the people, I can use people like my slaves and I can hire people, I can fire people, I can build somebody's career and I cannot, I can destroy others career. Well, you need to think seriously that maybe another human being is not capable of harming you in any which way. But the universe can. If you are gropped with ego, if you are gropped with what we call in Hindi ahankar, uh, if you are uh, behaving unethically, then the universe knows and has its way to bring it down you to the equality. And therefore it is important for each one of us to be grounded, to be humble, to be realistic. More important, the second lesson that I learned is that life is precious and that we must respect the life. As much as we care for other hours life, we must care for others life as well. And therefore, we have no way in charge of somebody else's life. For what we want to be treated, people with us, we should treat with others. If we want others to respect us, then we should respect the other individuals, no matter what work that individual is doing. So that is uh, lesson number two, is that every life form is precious and important. The third uh, most uh, important lesson and realization that I had that nature has its way of recuperating, revitalizing, regenerating, reproducing. It is human being who has been playing a demon and an intrusive into the nat natural world that we created the situations such as climate change, the melting uh, continents uh, uh, in Antarctic and uh, Arctic. Uh, we created situations where there is pollution, population explosion, industrializations. Our greediness must stop. Unless our greediness does not stop, then there will be many more calamities that will come because nature knows its way to neutralize things, to restore balance, uh, and uh, harmony. The other thing that I realized that your uh, medical science might have progressed as much, but what world needs and what uh, humanity needs in true sense is simply compassion, love and thoughts of healing. That is what it is. Because life when it goes it goes at a click of a moment and then you don't even have minute to think about what you did right and what you did wrong. Therefore, sharing compassion with people, uh, loving them, 
um, in a, a spiritual sense and sharing thoughts of healing with them is something that we must not forget to do at all time. The other thing that I have realized that the society's weakest and neglected, uh, 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 neglected uh, masses are the ones who comes to your rescue uh, when it is an emergency time. It is those security guards, it is those milk vendors, vegetable vendors, it is those chemist shops, it is those sanitary workers, those housekeeping staff that actually helps you. Those drivers whom we don't uh, probably at times treat properly. Uh, policemen towards whom we do not look nicely, at least in my part of the world. Uh, nursing staff with whom we behave very rudely and doctors as well. These are the individuals who come to your rescue. Those uh, NDRF staff, the National Disaster uh, Force staff, these are the individuals that will come to your rescue. So have a highest regard for them. Above all, have a highest regard for life. The other thing that I realized that the true spirit of being human is to be at the service of humanity and is to be at the service of uh, every single life form and non-living life forms on this planet Earth. That is the true worship of the divine, that is the true worship of the God that you understand and that you worship and dedicate your life to, continue to do service. At this critical juncture, your character will be known to people, the truest character. Are you behaving unethically? Are you looting too much from people? or? Are you shying away from doing community service wherever it is possible and where it, the opportunity knocks your door? People are noticing it. Okay, You may think that I will save myself. Well, saving yourself alone is not important. If your community is not saved, you will not be saved. You may in a family decide that you can shout and you can get things done from your Kamwali Bai, your housemaid or your security staff. But remember, if these people get contracted, they will eventually contract you with the deadly virus. Therefore, don't think that your world remains in the four walls of your house. Your world extends beyond that. And therefore, wherever possible, take care of the other individuals as well. And those individuals who are helping you at this point in time, respect them uh, with care, love, compassion. Give them uh, the words of gratitude. Acknowledge their, recognize their services. Okay, That is what it means. Uh, and those are some of the lessons that I learned uh, from this uh, the entire experience of lockdown and fight against the corona uh, virus pandemic but again these are just simple set of uh, uh, lessons there are many more micro level revelations and it shall take some time to share them uh, with uh, in a my in a minuscule details and uh, analyze them as to why those lessons are the way those lessons are but in general have the highest value for your own life and for the life of others care for others and the humanity will care for you stay home stay safe and god bless you